wearing dark. Well, I'm also got, I'm short naked today. Well, no, it just, I stand back to begin with, remember, because yeah. I'm back, I always look smaller, but, you know, this is old camera. This is not a spring chicken. Today we're going to give you our review of the LG Thrill. As you know, here in the United States, it is on the carrier AT&T. Yeah, I think it's called, it's actually the LG Optima out of this country. Mm -hmm. It's been available for a long time in, in Europe, but it took like six months to get it over to here. I know, they've had a few hiccups. We're finally glad, because this is a cell phone we have been waiting for. I don't want to say waiting for month by week by week and updates and um, because well, yeah. we've been monitoring, because we've been wanting a three, we've been waiting for a 3D cell phone yeah, we actually on our carrier. Two of them at the same time. Mm -hmm. So, you know, most people buy one, but we bought two because the price was really good. Because what happened was, my uh, I've been waiting like a half a year or more, actually going on almost what, eight months, because my phone basically mm -hmm. could be replaced. I was waiting for this one because we you know we were at CES and they were talking about this one. Mm -hmm. And the problem was during the meantime, we were hearing a lot of, well, we were waiting a lot of bad mouth the other equipment. Well, and there's one, there's actually only one other cell phone in 3D that's available on the market, which is the HTC Evo, yeah. which is available on Sprint. Now, a lot of times people are going, oh, this one's better and that one's better. Today, we're going to be talking about the LG Throw. I'll bring up some things on the Evo as I know it. Part of it is we're familiar with this because we've been testing it for about a month. Yeah, um, two, no, two different we people. basically tested it under field condition. Just mm -hmm. been tested at the beach. The sound quality was a heck of a lot better than what we would have thought out there. It, you know, here's the surprising part: is I would probably say that the sound quality on this when we're shooting it. Now we're talking at the beach with the waves, with the wind, was probably better than some of the. Um, well, we, the, we can't some shoot. Some of our cameras. We cannot shoot without, um, without mics yeah. with some of our cameras. But this did a pretty good job, and it's not like. We were that close to one another either because she was, uh, well first we start off with the fact that we well, a tip about the camera. Most people bitch about the camera because when you look at the camera like this, the 3D sucks. Well the problem is if you read any of the instructions it says you've got to hold it out at least about So instead of watching length, it here you should be out like this. Which is why we were, we're not doing this. We just got through shooting a piece where I did this to shoot for six minutes and if you hold it like that for six minutes you, you know. So most people are still going to shoot it like that, no. So, but um, no, but we were we were th this far a leaps from one another, and probably about that three times, you know, that much further, so that we could get. Because the trick is, when it's on 3D, it's point and shoot, which means you only get this. So, if you want anything else, you're going to have to sit there and um, uh, you know switch. To, if you want the whole body, you just got to back up, get the whole body, and so we backed up to do it. But uh, I know the chair dog had decided to, to, she missed the mailman, folks. And when she misses the mailman, deliver mail, she has to show how tough she is. Uh -huh. Yeah, like that's going to get her a bone a biscuit for coming in after the mail has been delivered. So she's hiding out. She went into her, her kitchen channel. But, um, so one of the things that you will be find missing from our review is like this total list of specifications. We figure... That's easy enough, you guys can find it on the internet, but what we're going to talk about is actually how the specs are and utilizing the cell phone to give you a better experience, the pros and cons yeah. of utilizing so we it. We can tell you though, it is 5.7 inches, which makes it a long camera. And if you look at the size of my hand. Yeah, and it's 2.67 inches wide and nearly a half inch deep and weighs uh, 5.93 ounces, which is why I said I'm not back there holding the camera. Nobody's mm -hmm. got to hold it like that for the length of this thing, but... Um, if, so for what that means to you is, depending on the size of your pocket, it will fit or not fit. Okay, so this is why, because I have my case. I mean, she's got, a, she's got an arm on that one. I hold it in something like this, and then I use... Uh, so because the problem is that um, I have a, a Bluetooth here thing here, you know, a Bluetooth here, but but uh, you know, otherwise you're sitting there talking for, uh, you know, when you're doing business, you would sit there and talk it for 20, 30 minutes with the ear thing like that. Well, that's like, that's one of the things. If you talk to, uh, like I talk to my friends on the telephone, if you're not wearing your Bluetooth earpieces because of the size of this phone, this happens with this phone as well as others, because the size is so large. When you, you're talking on the telephone and you get your ear too close, a lot of times you end up muting, holding, disconnecting people. 
Because the screen's so large. Yeah, you know, and it's, uh, you know, there's a, a reason, too, that besides the fact, you know, that it's 3D, because, uh, I mean, I don't know if I get just what she's talking about. I'll get something. You won't be able to see it. You'll probably hear the noise on it, so. But, um, go here, and, uh, yeah, go on. They, 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 they really neat. I mean, if you can play with this stuff, look for the galleries. Oh, he, he's having fun, you know, scrolling through his apps on yeah, the cell phone. Yeah. Um, when you're utilizing this, one of the things that we focused on is the camera, and the video camera, and that's because, of course, we do production, and we're using cameras and video all the time, and we, and we work with 3D. So, first of all, and some of the things that may be important to you on that, is the camera, it is glasses-free 3D. Yeah. yeah, that means you can watch 3D without the glasses. You can shoot it in... 2D and watch it in 2D or 3D. Actually, when you shoot it in 3D, I think you can also watch it in 2D. You, if you shoot yeah. it in 3D, you can take 3D. the 3D off and watch it in 2D. Yeah, I'm, you know, I'm sitting there going, and part of it is, is one of the things that we discovered is if you take the photo in 2D, it's a larger photo. If you take it in 3D, the output that it comes out when you do it, send it out as a 2D photo. Yeah, remember I said a 3D and you change it to a 2D ends up being basically a large thumbnail so the picture is a lot smaller. And you go, well, wait a minute, how can you do that? Well, because when you take a 2D or a 3D picture, actually, you take a 3D picture, you can email it to somebody else in a 2D or a 3D file. Uh-huh. <laughs> and you go, uh-huh, yeah. Well, I'm never any good at getting these things. <laughs> when, you get it. when you're taking the picture, you can take the picture looking this way, taking the picture this direction, or you can take the picture of yourself looking this way, which is great. The flash, of course, is on this side, so obviously if you're shooting the picture there, you can get a flash. If you shoot it towards you, your flash is going to be missing. But you can also shoot video. Yeah. Mm-hmm. On this 2D or 3D. On the 3D video, of course, since the lenses are on this side, you can only shoot 3D video going this direction. If you shoot towards you, right, or that way, you can shoot 2D either direction. I know. Here I got. Oh, are you showing the the video that we did? I'm trying to show the video that we just did. You just click, click on it, tap on it. I did. I didn't. I'm gonna go see if I can go. Got pictures. I did shoot video. I know what she's saying here. Oh, there it is again. You know, she did it. Good. <laughs> I got an image done. I don't want the image. One of the biggest things we found, besides the viewing thing, is um, when we had first bought it, one of the guys says, you know those don't work that well. We're like, what are you talking about? I said, we want the camera anyway. One of the things that we discovered, because we shoot with photo as well as video all the time and we do a lot of work with 3D, is that the, three, the 3D works better and the cameras work better with faster chips. Yep. And no, that is not just a marketing employee for them to get you to spend more money. It really does make a difference. If you're just shooting like standard stuff, maybe you're okay. But having it right fast to the chip is <coughs> great for action shots, for panoramas, um, you can't, for a video. It does. I mean, you cannot, um, you know, you can't. Can't, uh, what happens is, is that on a smaller chip, we were so oh, yeah. rudely interrupted by the mailman. Wait, wait, okay, because she got her brand new case, which is you know, totally okay. What she does is she armor plates everything she owns because she drops them. I know, and you're thinking, yeah, it takes up more space. Yeah, but oh, I yeah, protect it. well, because this is the case for mine without an armor plate. Hers comes. Well, I have, a, I have a plate on here, and then I've got a mirror yeah. on here. <laughs> and it fits nicely in And then we've just got this case to put it on, and then you can it put it here. It fits on your belt. So, it, you know, this one basically hasn't come off my belt yet, but there's a problem with guys, though, because you got to remember, folks, if your guy going to the bathroom, take it off your belt. Well, actually, one of the things, what we'll mention this is, there's a lot of people that think that cases for cell phones are just for girls. No. No, it protects your cell phone. I have, uh, okay, I don't necessarily wear a suit all the time. Our, are jackets with inner pockets. Mm -hmm. So if you don't have an inner pocket, you don't put this thing in your pants pocket because the god thing, thing weighs, you know, what is it, five pounds? And well, the, other, <laughs> the other part is I'm dropping my, like my other cell phone, I'm dropping my cell phone all the time. Yeah. And I don't know about you, how many people have you seen with their cell phone with a huge cracked? Yeah. Right? 
it, it, it's cracked, okay. right? Or the screen's all messed up. Yeah. So part of it is, is I put a case on it so that when I drop it, it hits the case it first. It generally hits the case and not the screen because what it does, it flips the weight down. I've mm -hmm. got a protective shield on mine, which we're going to have on her soon also, but what is that 5.3 ounces, I, I think that's enough. I think it's 5.9. No, it ounces. says 5.93. Almost 6 ounces. It's almost 6 ounces. I have my doubts that it's just a 6 ounces. But here's a part that I'm really excited about is when the, the cases, I used to have all my cell phones because the cell phones used to have a hole on it so you could put a, attach a lanyard to them. And people are going, why would you do that? Well, what happens is when we are at events, we're really busy and, you know, people don't always like have their cell phone or, you know, wherever. Is on this one, here's the cool part is I can put a lanyard through the top of this, right? And so when you're throwing it in the bag, you attach this in the lanyard, you're looking for yourself and you just grab it out of your bag. Well, it makes because it really I used to have, um, you know, my other cell phone had a lanyard attached to it in the mm -hmm. corner. I no longer do. Well, it just helps to keep track of it. Because how many times are you like, oh, I lost your cell phone, it dropped this, you can't find it. Was it really in the purse? Where'd it go? Yeah, because we're... Oh. Like, uh, because you're here, you more than likely hear the sound quality from that distance. Really? Actually, it's pretty good. And this, this, this was an earlier piece that was shot with this camera. 